The bad news, Mr Sunak, is I'll be out round the country fighting, campaigning, appearing on media, supporting Richard Tice in absolutely every single way. Reform UK is shaking up the general election campaign in the UK, pulling to within two points behind the Tories in a shocking YouGov poll. The latest survey conducted just before the ITV debate has put Labour leading the race with 40%. The Conservatives on 19%, Reform UK on 17%, the Liberal Democrats on 10% and the Greens on 7%. If that wasn't enough of a nightmare for Rishi Sunak, he is being investigated by the UK's official statistics regulator for his claim that Labour will hike household taxes by £2,000. I think people who work hard and aspire to provide that education for their kids should have that freedom. That's what my parents did, and I'll support it. But you heard it. Keir Starmer is going to raise taxes. But that's just the start, because there's a long list of other things that he needs to find the money for. So it's not just going to start and stop there. There are £2,000 worth of tax rises coming for every working family in this country. And as I said, he's saying to you he's going to raise well, taxes. I do, I do need to that's not the that. start. But Mr. Sunak's frosty attack hasn't landed well among shadow ministers who have accused him of lying to voters. Shadow Chancellor Rachel Reeves has said Mr. Sunak lied 12 times during the first debate. It was Rishi Sunak who lied 12 times in the debate about Labour's tax plans. The truth is it's the Conservatives that have taken the tax burden to the highest it's been in 70 years. As Reform UK is polling just two points behind the Tories, this latest survey of around 2,000 people will cause alarm in Conservative headquarters as it points towards a Tory wipeout on the 4th of July. With Labour on 40%, it gives Sir Keir Starmer a 21-point lead over the Tories, enough for a huge majority in the Commons. Parmeshwar Bhava for NDTV.